You've been talking for so long and your jaw start hurting like crazy. <laughs> Makeup, different bed. <laughs> um, so yeah, today, well, right now I want to talk to y'all about what I plan on getting during the Sephora sale. Um, I'm VIP Rouge, so I get 20% off. Yo, yo, and I didn't get VIP Rouge actually spending money on makeup, which is crazy. I got it spending money on perfume and skincare, <laughs> which is crazy, but it's all sold at Sephora, so yeah. And they're like, I need to spend $600 to keep Rouge through next year. I'll probably spend it just because um, I've been buying a lot of skincare and like stuff for my lips and things that I like. And perfume, I really have been getting back into perfume. Like I used to be a diehard Victoria's Secret Bath and Body Works perfume lover. And uh, you know, that was my culture. You know, I didn't know nothing about that Givenchy, you know? And I said, I don't know, what, do they have perfumes? I, I was just making up because I like the name Givenchy. <laughs> but yeah, I just want to talk quickly about what's in my Sephora wish list and then what is actually in my basket. Because my basket right now is actually at $273. $273. So yeah. I just wanted to talk to you about where I'm getting and maybe what you plan on getting. Okay. So first, I also plan on using the 100 points. They sent me a little thing in the mail saying that the 100 points would be available. Um, but yeah. Yeah, so that's that. So yeah, now I've ranted for 2 minutes and 45 seconds. Let's actually talk about what's in my freaking cart and what I might want to add to my cart and chat about things that I'm not sure about that I want to get. So the first thing is a Bite Beauty Agave Lip Mask. I got this as a sample for my birthday or a random sample. I don't know. I get these samples all the time. Like sometimes I'll click a different sample and that sample will come to me. But I really like the lip mask. Um, the lip scrub is just a lip scrub to me. Um, and also I do have, I think, the new, they reformulated their lip balm. It's now the Agave Plus Daytime Lip Balm. So I got that in here too. So the lip mask is $26 and that's a lot, but you get 0.52 ounces of product and I think that's a good set. <laughs> that's a good amount of product for a lip mask because you don't use it a lot. And also I hate the Laneige sleeping mask. Like I'm thinking about doing a video about things YouTube loves that I hate. <laughs> Um, cause I don't like it. It dried my lips out. I used it for about a month. The first week was fine, you know, it was good. And then the second week I was like, my lips are dry. And like, I was using it every night. And then like, people are like, oh, don't use it every night. So I use it every three nights. Same thing. I don't know what's wrong. I don't like it. Plus I didn't like having to dip my finger in. This is a squeezy tube. So I paid the $600 for a squeezy tube. But yeah. So that and the daytime lip balm. Um, I'm done with my Drunk Elephant one. I'm almost done with my Jack Black one. I have a difference of basil lemon. I don't like the basil lemon flavor. You get the original if you plan on getting it. Um, so yeah, I'm trying the Sagave lip balm, which is actually more than, I should just get the Jack Black. Okay, we'll, we'll see how that goes. Cause the Jack Black is only $7.50. This is $14. You know what, I think I might move to Jack Black into here. Let me, I'm removing it from my cart. Okay. We're making good choices, guys. I know you're not here, but you're here. You're here in spirit. Um, so let's move on. Next, I have this daily microfoliant exfoliator mini from Dermalogica. Um, it's only 15 bucks. Um, I was just getting this instead of they have like a trio where you can get like other things. Um, but you still only get the mini of the daily microfoliant. Um, so I think you, I don't know, do you? Cause I'm just gonna get the mini, I'm gonna try it out, see how I like it. Um, and then I also have the double clinch travel set from Dermalogica and people are saying like, it's a small mini, but like, that you can get as like a point perk, but Dermalogica has never been a point perk for me personally, or even at Ulta, I've never seen it as a point perk. So don't know what they're talking about, but 
Um, I'm gonna try it. It's 10 bucks for the travel set and that's how much I paid for the First Aid Beauty and the uh, It Cosmetics one. Well, it Cosmetics was 12, but then I got 20% off of it. You know that time was before I was having like 20% off every weekend? Like you got 20% off, then you got 20% off sale, then you got 20% off sale again, then you got 20% off sale two weeks later, and it was just like, bruh, stop having sales. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I basically paid $10 for these travel sets, and then I find out like, oh, I like this. Now I can get the full size. But like, you know, I have other cleansers, so that's why I really only want the trial set because I have the Ose cleanser that I got in my Pop Sugar box, and I got the Tula cleanser, which I got in my Fat Fit Fun box. And then I also still have the Clinique oil controlling cleanser, and then I had the Tatcha dual cleanse, which I got at the last for VIP sale. So that's four big cleansers. I don't need another big cleanser. So like these minis will like be able like the days when I'm like, oh, I don't need that deep of a cleanse. You know, I can work the minis in or like travel. Minis on travel really tell you how they work because you're working on stress from traveling. I don't know, I get stressed when I travel, so I need a new travel thing. Plus it's got a special pre-cleansing gel that people say is really good for removing your makeup. Um, but next is this Bite Beauty Amuse Bouche Liquefied Lipstick. And this is the Unearth Collection in Kohlrabi. Now this is on sale for 12 bucks. So that's why I'm gonna get it. Also, it looks like a dupe for the color from Fenty, the purple one. Um, I have a wet and wild one, I don't love it. But I'm gonna try to use it more with a lip brush to see if like it gets better. Um, but I'm trying to find dupes because I don't need another stunner lip paint because I have three and you're like, man, I bet you just find another lipstick, but these are cheaper. The Wet n Wild one was $4.99 and I got 50% off. So really I only paid $2.50 for it. So like, like that's not $24. <laughs> but here's the thing, I own one of these. Um, it's in like a wine, mold wine color. I don't love the formula, but granted, I haven't been wearing that one. And I didn't wear it all day because like I was going to school and I was like, I was wearing bright purple eyeshadow. And I was like, I wanted a purple lip. So I'm going to get it because I'm recreating that Alyssa Ashley look again correctly. I found out what shade she was using in that the Tasha Denona palette. So I'm either going to wear that wet and wild lip or this lip or mix them to try to get a formula that I like. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, the next thing is the Cinema Secrets Makeup Brush Cleaner, which I'm kind of upset about because it's going to make my package ship slower because it has to be shipped ground. Um, but I'm getting the big size, 32 ounce. Uh, Cause I think the small size is only eight ounces and I went through that quickly. I can clean all my eyeshadow brushes with the smallest amount of liquid. So if I only clean my eyeshadow brushes, which are things I need the most cleaning quicker. The next thing I'm getting is the Charlotte Tilbury Matte Revolution Lipstick in the color Birkin Brown. Can you Hermes, Hermes bag? Hermes, is it H-Silent Hermes? Anyways, a Birkin Brown because all the new lipsticks I've been getting are pink. I think I talked about this in my last video. I'm tired of a pinky nude, yo. Done. Electric chair. <laughs> like, I'm done. Like, I just want a good freaking color that's brown. And, like, uncuffed. This might be the same color as uncuffed. I think it's uncuffed the brown one. The brown one from Fenty that's super dark. This is like a lipstick, so I feel like I could sheer it out. Like, it's hard to share out the Fenty one. Okay, next thing I'm getting is the Fenty Beauty um, Pro Filter Instant Retouch Setting Powder. This is something I don't know if I need right now, but it's about to be summer, so I feel like I need it. Okay, the next thing I'm getting is the Sparsali Skin Tune Blur. I know I said they're like things that don't excite me, um, but this is the only thing I think I said that excited me, the Skin Tune Blur. Honestly, you know what I feel like I should get? The mini of the Fenty and the mini of the Farsali because like if I truly like it, I can go back and get the full size like for my money and like it's my money. It's just I have so many powders that I don't think I need a full size of the Fenty and I don't know if I like the skin too blur. See, that's why I talk to y'all. Okay, so let me, let me open these up. The last thing I'm getting is the Drunk Elephant Slay. Slay makeup melting butter um yeah i really want that i love makeup removers and then let me go to jack black 
which does he own this company or is it just people using his name so like I said I I only tried the basil lemon my dad has tried the lemon and shea butter and I think my sister had shea butter and vitamin E they're eight dollars now I might get two of these which is sixteen dollars but I get two so I'm gonna get the natural mint and shea butter and then I'm gonna get the shea butter and vitamin E I think that's a better value because I get two for just a little bit more money okay rather than um one and like how much product do you get in these where are you at you get 0.25 which is more than um you get 0.25 you only get 0.15 in the drunk elephant and the bite beauty ones and i like these better i want that dolce and gabbana the only one i really want that but it's 94 dollars I can get a mini though for $29. Is it? Oh, it's a travel spray. Low key, I might get this mini, y'all. Because I love this scent. From the moment I smelled it on that little, it's like one of those little, um, little things you open and you, you sniff. And like, I loved it. And so, I might get that. But, uh, yeah, that's all I got for you today. So as always, I look great, you look great, we all look great, and I hope you have a great day.